Hi guys, it's Angelia. How's everybody doing? Today is Vlogmas Day 10, so another day for showing you my ornaments that I've uh, made up, <laughs> or ornament. Anyway, I've got or ornament number 10 finished, and uh, it's teeny tiny. <laughs> it, these ones that are tiny take me a little while to do. They're kind of tedious, because you got all these little bitty parts you got to put it on, and a lot of sewing. And I had to use a tiny hook for this one. I used a worsted weight yarn, but boy howdy, this one was <laughs> tiny. I've made a few in the past, and so I decided I wanted to make another one for my tree over here that's got all my other ornaments on it. And this one is a free pattern, and uh, here it is. <laughs> this one is a free pattern by Sharon of Amigurumi to Go, and it's called uh, Amigurumi Pocket Mouse. And she's actually got one even tinier than this. <laughs> yeah. But this one was uh, a lot of fun to make. And I think she turned out really cute. And she's actually got little paper clips on the bottom to make it look like she ice skates. <laughs> so, anyway, um, I used, uh, I think this is Patty Green by Red Heart Super Saver. Uh, the Mainstay White. And then this is a uh, gray mist or gray slate gray mist i think by hobby lobby i love this yarn and the eyes i used some little tiny beads and then i just whip stitched its nose little pink nose but i think she turned out so sweet <laughs> but she is tiny but uh um i like sharon she does a really good job at showing you how to to make them and stuff she's actually one of the ones that taught me how to crochet, uh, Jada was the first one. Her and then a, a lady named um, Paula Danielli, I believe was her name. And uh, I don't think she does videos anymore, but she was another one that I watched. She never did make an amigurumi. She did made hats and stuff like that. But Sharon, she's the uh, one that I've done a lot of her amigurumis. But anyway, I'll put a link down below in the description box if you'd like to try one. But it is tiny. <laughs> She'll look cute over there on the tree. Look like she's skating. <laughs> okay, now the next thing I want to show you is a couple of treasures that I found in a box whenever I went to a Goodwill store. This was sometime last year, right after Christmas. I wanted to go look and see, you know, what people had donated. And when I went in, I looked around and I seen some stuff, but then I found a box. And on the front of it, it was written, uh, the word Christmas was written on there. And the price had a dollar on it. And so, I, of course, I asked the lady to make sure if that was right. And she said, yeah, because they just wanted to get rid of it. Well, in the box, I found some treasures. And the couple I want to show you are these. <sighs> now, I really don't know anything about them except they're made out of a uh, corn husk and uh, I don't know what their hair is made out of but it sure it's they're pretty I really like them I think they're precious and they're very fragile and uh, and they're pretty good shape for being stuck down in a box with a bunch of stuff piled on it <laughs> but on the bottom it says Nana's I think and it says 88 I believe it was the date or 86 but uh I think they're precious and they were somebody's treasures at one time so they're mine now <laughs> but there was two of them and so they hang on my tree and uh, I really like them but anyway yeah that was my treasures I want to show you for tonight and I guess I'll hop off of here and see if I can look for another ornament I'm gonna try to get one that's not so uh, tiny or maybe not as tiny but maybe not as tedious to do <laughs> a lot of work on that one <laughs> i might pick a real simple one for tomorrow but anyway i'm going to let you guys go and i hope you all have a wonderful blessed evening and i will be chatting at you tomorrow on vlogmas day what is it 11 i think so <laughs> i lost track of time anyway i'll chat at y'all soon